Hi there, this is Amanda from the Social Media Cafe. And what a lot of changes on Facebook today, crumbs. Um, if you're in the UK, you may not have seen it yet. Um, if you change your settings up here to, and go home first, then go account settings, and change your language to English US by clicking edit and then ch choosing it from the pop down and save changes you will see it because it has rolled out across the UK now if you want to see some of the changes let me go and show you um, I'm not going to enable the secure browsing because that causes me grief on some of the fan pages but at some point we will need to be doing that. Um, there's all sorts of new things. So let's go and have a look over here first. This is a ticker of things that are going on. So I happen to know David. Let's have a click and see um, who it is he's chatting to and what he's done. He's just connected with somebody called Sandra Hodgson. And that's cool. Um, there's all sorts of things going on here. I can click on that and I might want to go and join in on the conversation. Or I might want to hide it, remove it, report it or whatever. So I can just see all that ticking down here in the corner. Now, let's go and have a look at other things. I can actually change what I'm seeing because of these smart lists. These are being made up of very different things where you can add them to your list. So introducing close friends that you can add to the list. So I can add Sarah and I can add Angie and Angus, Keith, Chris, Dave, Debbie, Ali. Well, I could go through the whole lot really and start adding but this list can be whatever you want it to be and you can add and change and do whatever you fancy so that's cool and I liked this edition as well this is people in and around the London area so again you can start adding people to that list and when you add them their profiles added to it and then they can choose London as their current city or accept or ignore. You can add it to the list or you can cancel it. So how cool is that? So it is stopping you putting people in an area where they shouldn't be. So that's quite cool. Um, there are quite a few other changes as well. If I go across to the fan page, I've done some picture screenshots of some of them. So that was the location one that I've just shown you. Um, one of the other changes that Facebook have made is you can see where people have seen things from. So on here, um, Barbara was interacting with me about sharing some information and a lady called Marguerite Cross joined in and it actually said just above it, friends with Barbara Patterson. So that was quite cool. I quite liked that um, change. Um, let's have a look and see. This isn't one of the recent changes, i.e. it came in this latest batch, but it is about a week or so ago it started posting. When you send an update to your fans on a fan page, you used to be able to send it to them all. They're stopping you as of the 30th of September, so you will no longer be able to see the updates. So if you were using that feature, I'm afraid you're going to have to start posting it to the wall now. Oh, account settings. Um, they're up here now. These have moved around a little bit. And you can still go to your own profile. But also on the home one, which is just to the right of it now, it got me a little bit confused earlier when I was looking for it. It has a pull down menu with account settings, privacy settings and using Facebook as a page. So it's now in the pull down menu just above. And there's, you know, good.
good and bad in everything and all the changes. I know there's an awful lot more coming from the Facebook camp in the next couple of months because they have a big conference, um, a developers conference at the moment, which is all a little bit scary really. Um, so we've talked about the Facebook tickers. Now this is quite cool that I saw earlier and I think again this has been around a little while, the location edition. Um, I spotted that you couldn't see this in your pages but you can see it in the groups so you can actually add a location and you can add who you're with so let's just go to one of my groups and I can show you so let's go to the social media cafe closed group and when you start typing something can you see here you can add whoever you're with and you can change the location when you're posting it in the group so that's quite clever as well I quite like that one so hopefully there's going to be some fun going on and I'm going to see some interesting things from you guys please feel free to come to the social media cafe and post what you like what you don't like what changes you think should happen and we'll have a chat <laughs>